Unnoticed Heroes Beyond Color photo exhibit. And this was part of a project of collaboration and partnership that we had with the STEM Alliance. We were, the first weeks we were learning about photography and how it works. And we decided we were going to do a project about it. And we wanted to do like some people that aren't noticed much in the community. So we made posters like these, to, and we hung them up in every school so people can see them and learn about these people. This project, Unnoticed Heroes Beyond Color, is really about what young people in our community are seeing, who they're noticing, who they care about. Uh, and for me, I think, and for the rest of my team, I think to, to, to just look at the perspective of our leaders um, and see things that they don't see and to, to notice and now next time I'm in the community and I see the people they've identified I'm going to say thank you because of these young leaders I see you too. I think one of the most exciting things for Sal and I were to see these young people grow in confidence um, and develop new ways of seeing through the camera because looking through a lens forces you to really see things in new ways. We learn to see and communicate the strengths of our community and the things we think need to change. And together use the power of photography to tell stories and raise awareness. Not many teachers get an invitation to do this. Ella ama a la profesora Gaudio, entonces estoy contenta, como dijo Girandi, de que ellos puedan dar a conocer a estas personas que tal vez nosotros no sabíamos de ellos, y ahora los tenemos aquí y sabemos un poco más de ellos. For us at the Community Resource Center, it's really important to give voice to young people. Uh, of course, we, we empower their parents, but we can't serve families holistically unless we also work with their children. As Latinos, as immigrants, as, as families who have grown up here, uh, they see the world in a totally different way. Uh, and I think it's really important for us as a community to identify from their perspective, who are they seeing, who are they identifying as heroes, um, and how do we uh, work together to make everyone feel like they're a part of this community. So I'm really excited about this project. I think these, these young leaders have really shown up every week and, sh and showed us like what to see and how to see it. And I'm excited to get to know some of these people a little bit more. So there's a QR code and it will bring up on your device uh, the, the poster if you'd like to spend more time reading it and looking at it at home. We re recognize that a lot of people will be walking past or driving past this exhibit um, and may not have the time. So if you have a chance to just take a pic quick of one of the QR codes, um, you'll have access to all the photos as well as a two question um, form of just asking how, you, how it made you feel giving us some feedback on, on the exhibit in hopes that we'll be doing this again and uh, involving even more people. We, we do a lot of programs and services. This is just one of the programs and services that we do. Um, if you're interested in learning more about, about you know, youth programs or educational programs for, for adults, please contact us. Uh, we are currently and temporarily at St. Thomas Church on 168 West Boston Post Road, or you can contact Marco at 914-835-1512.